Harkian on Fern Agraha, Bovalium Falcia O'Cree, a cor Roiv Galair, Coig Oskilt Ifigul, Star Quina August Irocht, Cogoil Trilo, a Camora Kate Blian on Coganagarad, a Kiri, August Nias Fade again. Tasologuin Gamenenshiv Tahanov, as an Ocoid on a Specialta, August Starul Shaw. Kahirlik of Kerry County Council, Chief Executive of Kerry County Council. Elected representatives, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. I would like to extend a very warm welcome to each and every one of you to the official opening of History, Memory and Legacy, a three-day conference marking the centenary of the Civil War in Kerry and beyond. On behalf of my fellow organisers, Bridget McAuliffe and Mary McAuliffe, I would like to thank you all for being here for what we hope will be three days of thought-provoking, stimulating and exciting discussion debate and engagement on the Civil War in this centenary year, with a particular focus on the events of, a, of um, a century ago in this county. Over the coming days, we have a very varied programme of events, which, given the level of interest and bookings, has clearly appealed to a very wide audience. We are thrilled and humbled in equal measure that capacity crowds will come here this evening and over the coming days to participate in and engage with this conference one of the final events in this decade of centenaries. As well as the in-person events here at Shim Satira, we are live streaming all of our lectures, keynote addresses and roundtable discussions on our website, kerrycivilwarconference.ie. So if you know anybody who's unable to make it in person, or anyone who's at home or perhaps even overseas and would like to view the proceedings, please share the link with them. The idea for this conference was conceived exactly one year ago. And since then, Bridget, Mary and I have worked hard and devoted many hours to ensuring that the events we have arranged would be pre presented in an inclusive, accessible and respectful way, and with a wide reach to audiences locally, nationally and internationally. In fulfilling our ambition to mark and commemorate the events of 1922-23 in our native county, we received the support and backing of the Expert Advisory Group on Centenary Commemorations, represented here this evening by Dr. Martin Manzer, as well as the Department of Tourism, Culture, Arts, Gaeltacht, Sport and Media, and Minister Catherine Martin. We are honoured that this conference forms part of the official state programme for this year's commemorative events. From the outset, we also received the generous support and encouragement of the management and the elected members of Kerry County Council. I'd like to acknowledge the support of the Cahirlach, Councillor John Francis Flynn, and the elected members of the Council, as well as its Chief Executive, Moira Murrell, and the County Librarian, Tommy O'Connor, for assisting in securing funding from the Department for this conference. The conference is also presented in conjunction with our partners, UCD Gender Studies, Kerry Library, and the Department of Computing, Creative Media, and Information Technology at the Munster Technological University, Kerry Campus. Over the course of this evening and tomorrow and Saturday, you'll have the opportunity to enjoy some 20 experts, academics, and historians in a diverse and wide-ranging series of presentations and debates on the Civil War and its legacy. There is also a very special centenary concert on Saturday night, featuring song, poetry, drama and music from and about the Civil War in Kerry. Tickets for this very special commemorative evening are still available from the box office here at Shim Satira. Tomorrow night we have a screening of Bally CD, which was broadcast on RTE in 1997, and which will feature an interview with the presenter of the programme, Pat Butler. The event, as many expected, is at this point completely booked out. Finally, please don't leave the theatre over the weekend without visiting the conference exhibition, Misha Lamas, which you can find in the gallery outside. It's a truly moving, evocative and very creative interpretation of the events in Kerry and some of those involved in the seismic events of a century ago. It's presented by students at Kerry College and the Munster Technological University and I can promise you that you will be enthralled. Again, all of the information about what's coming up over the next few days <clears throat> is available in the conference programme, which you've received on the way in and on our website. And if you're on social media, please join the conversation by finding us on Twitter and Facebook and by using the hashtag Kerry Civil War Conference. Uh, we haven't got around to TikTok yet, but maybe we'll um, uh, figure that out over the weekend. Um, and so to the formalities this evening, 
Firstly, to officially open the Kerry Civil War Conference, would you please welcome the Cahirlach of Kerry County Council, Councillor John Francis Flynn. Thank you. Aguinaushla, distinguished guests, it is a tremendous honour for me as Cahirlach of Kerry County Council to welcome you to the National Folk Theatre of Ireland, Shim Satira. I am delighted to officially open this Kerry Civil War Conference which marks the centenary of the civil war in the county and beyond. It is very appropriate that this three-day conference is taking place in a county which was so scarred by the horrors of the Irish Civil War a century ago. The conflict left a long and painful legacy for so many families and communities, and it remains a difficult subject to engage with and to discuss. But it is important 100 years on from these events that we pause and reflect and consider why this period caused so much trauma and suffering and how we can discuss the civil war in a respectful and inclusive way. I would like to commend the organisers of the conference, Miriam Colliff, Bridget McAuliffe and Owen O'Shea for their initiative and hard work in bringing this conference to fruition. There is a very wide range in the agenda over the next three days including just not over 20 experts and academics, but also a film screening tomorrow night, a concert on Saturday evening, and an exhibition in the gallery here in this building. Kerry County Council is pleased to support this conference in conjunction with the Department of Tourism, Culture, Arts, Gaeltuck, Sport and Media, and the Decade of Centenaries programme. The programme has been so successful in facilitating the commemoration of the important events of a century ago. I am sure that this weekend will do justice to the Decade of Centenaries programme, which is now in its final year. If you are a visitor to Kerry, I hope you will find the opportunity to enjoy what Tralee has to offer over the coming days. It is a, it is a town with a long and fascinating history as well as many popular attractions and welcome places enjoying the customary Kerry hospitality. I wish everyone a very successful, enjoy, enjoyable few days. Goramil Namahagiv. <laughs>